Preservatives are required to maintain sterility in standard topical multi-dose ophthalmic eye drops. Above all, benzalkonium chloride, or BAC, a cationic detergent, is the gold standard and the most commonly used antimicrobial agent because of its powerful detergent action on bacterial walls and membranes. But BAC is also the most disruptive to the stability of the ocular surface unit, which comprises the tear film, conjunctiva and cornea. When a drop containing BAC arrives on the ocular surface, firstly, it breaks the superficial thin lipid layer of the tear film into numerous oil droplets by detergent action. This dissolution leads to free evaporation of water vapor and hence hastening drying of the ocular surface. In addition, BAC encourages partial destruction of the mucin-secreting goblet cells in the conjunctiva, which leads to dissolution of the mucin layer on the surface of the corneal epithelium, and so a destabilisation of the tear film. No longer protected, the corneal epithelium is altered by BAC with microvilli loss and rupture of the intercellular junctions. These all link to significant decrease of the cellular viability and increase of the permeability, inducing penetration of ionic solutions, lipophilic substances and microorganisms. All these mechanisms are linked together and lead to iatrogenic inflammation of the ocular surface. This inflammation will be prolonged by the repeated use of BAC, especially in chronic diseases such as dry eye syndrome or glaucoma, and could also, due to accumulation, impregnate deeper structures of the eye such as the trabeculum, lens or retina. This phenomena for the patient appears as irritation, burning sensations, pruritus, dryness, symptoms which could be minimised by the toxic effect of BAC on the corneal nerves. In summary, BAC by different mechanisms is directly dose-dependently cytotoxic to the tear film and the ocular surface cells and stimulates inflammatory disorders at the origin of a vicious circle of ocular surface disease.